You ready? Okay, tell Daddy you're ready. I'm ready. Okay, good. Okay, what are we gonna make? Bread. Okay, show Daddy a picture of what we're gonna make. Bread. Mm. We got this recipe from Pinterest. Yes. And I don't know who it is, but we're gonna give her props. The brown eyed baker, and she has the props. I have never made this recipe before. No way, I didn't see the, <gasps> no way. In my whole life, I didn't make that last night with my school, all my friends, all my teacher, all everybody at my school. And with that, we'll take another sip of coffee. Yes. <laughs> oh, we get tweaks. Mm -hmm. Why else? We take more fruits in this water bowl. Okay, tell Daddy, what's your name? Addison Tweak. Good. So Addison is my helper. We've never made it before, and we're still in our pajamas. So yeah. step one, I've written down all the steps from Pinterest. Yeah. Is to dissolve the yeast in three quarters of a cup of warm water, which we have right here. Yeah. Put your finger in it. Is it warm? We have washed, and we do not have the coronavirus. Yep. Yep. Okay. We're gonna get a fork, and you're gonna stir it gently with this fork. Okay, we're putting in two packets of 0.25 ounce yeast, fast rising yeast. Wow. Stir gently and slowly. Here we go. What's that smell called? It? It's called yeast. yeast. This makes bread grow. Can you smell it? <laughs> Does it smell good or not good? Okay, let's show the camera. This is what it looks like. Okay, my turn to stir. Okay, Mom. Good listening. Oop, stop, stop. Stuck on the fork. So not quite sure what we're gonna do about that, but we're just gonna try to tap it off, or maybe I'll just leave the fork in here. Oop, come on, you can stand up again. And we're going to let it sit for five minutes. So if you wanna zoom in, it's gonna start bubbling as the yeast becomes activated. And it's gonna start growing. So we will see you in. Five minutes. How long? Five. All right. And I, I'm looks like me, five. We're five. I'm five? No. How old am I? Four. I'm four? I like it. And Say, I, see you in a minute. See you in a minute. <laughs> the bunny jumped. <laughs> the bunny did jump. <laughs> we were occupying our time. The timer went off, so we have five minutes done. So we're gonna give it one more quick little stir. And the directions say, we're going to add the rest of the warm water. You know how me pour it in? Yeah. Here we go. Keep Good. mixing, okay, Mom? Okay, you keep mixing. What's your job? Mix. Good. Then, ooh, smell it, what does it smell like? Give it a smell. Yeah. It tastes <laughs> like poop bread. Poo poo bread? Yeah. Oh my gracious. Okay, and we're going to add in some sugar. We have a quarter cup of sugar. We're gonna dump some. Okay, okay. You dump it in. We made it in the bowl, folks. Barely. <laughs> okay, mix it up. Then we're gonna add in salt. We got one tablespoon of salt. I used kosher salt, so I did a little bit more because kosher salt is more dense, and you need to whoop whoop, and you need to increase the quantity. Yeah. And what's that, Mama? Mommy, what's that? That is a mixer. Every time Chi and I use that, every time we go on vacation. <laughs> That's right, when we go on vacation and holiday, we watch a lot of Peppa Pig in this house. Okay, we got sugar, salt, and this butter is cubed at room temperature. Good job. Okay, give it a mix. Okay. Sugar, salt, room temperature, butter, and we're gonna put in five cups of flour. Are you ready for this? Yeah. I don't think I'm ready for this. Okay, so. I'm ready. 
We gotta make sure it's totally even. All right, put that one in. Whoa. And no, no, oh, I got okay, it. wait, we're gonna mix this first. Okay. Whoa. Okay, dump it in. Two. You keep, you keep, <laughs> you keep mixing, Mom. Okay, I will. Oops. Oh, gracious. No, okay, I got three. It. Okay, you got it. Three. Woo! Hang on. <laughs> It's gonna be very messy. Four. One more. Four. And five. Okay. All right. Whoa. <laughs> okay, we're gonna scrape off the fork and we're actually gonna switch to a wooden. Go throw that in the sink, please. We're gonna switch to a wooden spoon. Yep. And. We're going to stir to combine. Here's what we look like right now. Um, I want to help. Stir. Oh, this time I want to stir okay. this time. We'll do a couple stirs together to make sure we don't push all the flour out the bowl. Mom, I just want to go have a go. All right, hang on. we got to get a little bit more of the ends in. Okay, you got to keep it all in the bowl. Give it a big stir. Four stirs for you and four stirs for me. So once this is combined, we're going to use a dough hook on this puppy. And we're gonna spe spin at low speed. All right, here we go. No, I got, I got it. Okay, you do three stirs, then I gotta do it. Good. One, it's already becoming real thick. Two, three. You wanna show yeah. daddy your big muscles? No, oh, you didn't show him your muscles. I did. Oh, you did? Can you show me how it looks like that? Yeah. So I'm kind of picking it up off the bottom to get and I'm helping all mommy. the flour out. And helping mommy. Yep. Do something and I'm Okay, so now. Now I know what you're doing. Now we're gonna put the dough hook on. This yeah. is a dough hook. I wanna help you. Yep. All right, it goes right here. Oh yeah. Right here, here we go. I know how to. Okay, here, we'll move it a little closer to you. How about that? Yeah. Okay. All right. Watch your hands. Yep. Okay. So I'm going to switch it from. Um, um, excuse me. Yes. Oh, gracious. All right. <laughs> so I'm going to use a spatula and just get this dough off this wooden spoon real quick. And hang on, hang on. Put it back over here. I need you. Thank you. All right. We're just going to take this all and plop it in. Just like this. That it's should... like a birthday cake. It is like a birthday cake. Okay. Turn it to show daddy what it looks like. Look. Show daddy. There you go. All right. Let's slide it on. we got to twist it until it locks. Okay. This is heavy. So I'm going to put the handle down. Come on. You help. Good, and over here is a button to lock it. Pull it back, good. And we are going to go on low speed until the dough is tacky, and then we're gonna let it go for five to seven minutes. Right there, low speed, and we're gonna watch it go. Now if you wanna look inside here, you see how long it takes to get tacky. Mixing it all up for you. Yeah, but the Dean and Dale is trying to not yeah. But how is not getting out of it? Well, because it's going to mix up. And so it's starting to kind of stick. It's getting close to getting tacky. It's still a little bit smooth. You want to look in the camera too? Yeah. Oh, 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 you guys are about to get seasick. There we go. I'm going to hold it this time. Okay. I don't know. Oh boy, here we go. There, good job. Wow. <laughs> okay. All right, so we're going to let this go for five to seven minutes, and we will be back. Say, we'll be back. How long? Five. All right. It's important to make a mistake. It's important to admit when you make a mistake. I did not read 
the rest of my directions. You're supposed to go at a low speed until it becomes tacky and you, re you add in the rest of the flour. So we're about to get flour crazy up in here. Uh-oh. Yeah. Okay, add a scoop. You gotta put it in careful. Oh boy. Good. Okay, add another scoop. Good. All right. Oh, gotta put in more. All right. More. Whoa. Oops. All right. More. <laughs> no. Oh boy. You know what? This is a great time to use an attachment. Let's get this. What? Me. Hey. Are going to put this on. Good job. <laughs> wow. So I encourage you if you have a KitchenAid to get this. Okay, you gotta pour it down right here, okay? There you go. Good job. Oh. Keep going. <laughs> Splashing out the sides. Good. So you're gonna keep on it says, using dough hook, mix a low speed, and slowly add the rest of the flour until the dough is tacky. Once it's tacky, then you let it go for five to seven minutes. Five to seven. That's right. Woo! Woo! <laughs> so, <laughs> the recipe calls for Flour. Nine to ten cups of flour. You don't necessarily have to use it all. Me? You. Uh, the flour is almost yeah. empty. Yeah, let's take a look at it real quick. We're almost at... Here, let me do one real quick. we got about a cup and a half left. Yeah, okay. I got it. Pour it. Whoa. Pour all of it in right there. Good. Okay, we'll stop there for a second. We're gonna look like grandmas after this because we have flour all over us. Okay, it's starting to form a little ball. I don't know if you want to come look at this. We're just gonna let it do its thing. I think we just saw some dough fly into my hair and it's gonna become a ball soon. Oh, nope, nope, no more. All right, see you in five to seven minutes. I took the lock off so that she could actually feel the dough forming. So we'll put the lock back on. Okay, hold it down. Is it trying to sneak out? Yeah. Is it doing good? Yeah. Alright. So, we're going to get this ready. We grease this bowl just with a little bit of olive oil spray. And we're going to transfer the dough to here so it can rise for 45 minutes. Now the recipe says to cover with plastic wrap. I'm just using a very thin towel. That's how my grandma did it. It's actually my grandma's towel. Super, super thin. Yeah, and super, super cute. It is super cute. What's on it? Uh -huh. Yes, very good. Okay, ask, ask her how much time is left on the timer. Alexa, how much time is left on the timer? Or what? Alexa, how much time is left on the timer? Alexa, Alexa, how much time is left on the timer? You have three minutes and 40 seconds left on the seven minute timer. So I'm gonna take a quick peek here because it actually looks really good to me right now. Um, it's not Wait, a perfect, yeah. It's not a perfect ball, but we're getting there. We're getting there. So we're gonna do about one more minute of kneading. You like that? It looks like a ball. It wasn't a ball. Yeah, it looks like a ball, but it's not a ball. We're not gonna good. plop this puppy right back in. Close it up. I know how to start. Okay, you do it. This way. Good. All right. Yeah, yeah, okay, no. you're holding it? All right. 
We'll see you in one minute. Find out how much time is left on the timer. Hmm? Ask her how much time is left on the timer. Alexa, how much time is left on the timer? You have one minute and 40 seconds left. All right. All right. Okay, open it up. We're going to transfer it to the big red bowl. Push. Push. All right, we're going to take it off the hook here. And again, this bowl is greased with a little bit of olive oil. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, lose the bowl. lost the bowl. Where is it? Where is it? You don't want to lose is it. it. All right. Nope, nope. You got to hold it and make a ball. Oh. <laughs> All right. It Ready? looks like an instrument, Mama. It does look like an instrument. Which instrument? Oh, like don't squish it. Oh, what? we're good. Okay, put the towel over it. How? Let me put the towel. Wow, this is messy. Good, just like that. And we're going to put it in a cool area where there's no draft. And we will see you in 45 minutes. How long? 45. We might actually get dressed. <laughs> Say see you in a minute. See you in a minute. Okay, what's your job? Um, Take some flour and put it on the table. You're going to put it on the counter? All right, put it on the counter. More. <laughs> we are back. The dough has risen, which I'll show you in a minute. We're going to make a big mess. <laughs> We're going to make a big mess. Okay, a little bit more. This is so fun. <laughs> okay, hang on. You ready to see what your bread looks like right now? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. All right. We went a little over 45 minutes. Oh my gracious! You know what we're gonna do next? What does it's it feel bread. like? What does it feel like? It is a little bit hard, huh? Yeah, it likes the It's like a drum, huh? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, you know what we're gonna do? What? We're gonna plop it and we're gonna squish it. You no, ready? No. You ready? Here it goes. Plop. Let's squish it. <laughs> oh, are you gonna help, buddy? Like we're gonna flip it and we're gonna squish it. Yeah, I always like an instrument. What we're doing right now is actually getting rid of all the air pockets so yeah. that when we bake the bread. Yeah, we like to bake a bread. A it's not going to have holes. No holes. No holes. Um, boom, boom, boom. You like this part? Okay, we're going to flip it. You ready? Flip. It's like a giant pizza, huh? It looks like a macaroni pizza. A macaroni like pizza. All right, just a little bit, not a lot. No, I have to keep it. Okay, right here? Just in case. Okay. <laughs> All right. Good. Yes. Spread it around. Mm -hmm. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to actually cut it, this puppy in half. I like it, my knife. And we're going to deal with one half at a time. I got my knife. Okay, cut right down here. Flip it over. There you go. Good. Good. Keep cutting. Good job. She will never be able to cut a steak. <laughs> all right, so we're going to deal with one piece at a time. Squish it all up. Squish it all up. Squish it all up. Uh, Flatten it out. Uh, flat, 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 flat. What flat. are we going to do that next? Next, we are going to make a big... Oh, we need our pin roller. Hang on. Pin roller. Roll. Where's it? I'm gonna roll it out. Ready? Oh no, roll it too. Grab that side. Good job. And then we're gonna get it the perfect size to fit into this. Okay. Okay. Roll, roll, roll. Mm. Roll, roll, roll. go. Here we go. I think you got the easier part of this job. And we're going to go a little sideways. Roll, roll, roll. Roll, 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 roll. OK. 
Okay, hang on. I'm trying to get a little square going, but it'll be close. It'll have very misshapen bread. And that's okay, because you can still eat it. Okay, we are I'm going to- some shapes. Yeah? <gasps> what do you say? Scared me! Okay, we will quickly roll, and then we will be going to the restroom. <laughs> Roll, roll, roll. No, roll, 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 roll. Very quickly, use a little olive oil spray. And plop this. Oh, and you gotta seal the edges right here. Okay, that was a premature flush. Not sure if you heard that. But the reason why you seal the edges is so that it actually grows together. So, put that puppy in there. And we're gonna let it rise even further. So we'll be back. All right, so I actually let this rise longer than 45 minutes because it needs to double in size. And I felt like it wasn't quite there, but now, oh, don't touch. Now it is. They look pretty good, huh? So we're gonna brush them with butter and we're gonna bake them on the lowest rack at 400 for 30 to 45 minutes. So yeah. we're gonna butter before we bake and then we're gonna butter after we bake. Yeah, so you I'm ready? gonna do this. I'm gonna show you one, then you do the next one, okay? Okay. So you do a dip dip, tap tap, like that. And you have to brush gentle. Okay. Dip dip. Tap tap. Good. <laughs> Good. Brush, brush, brush. Okay, brush this side too. Dip dip. Over here, tap tap. tap. <laughs> <laughs> My counters will never be the same. Good, okay, let me clean up a couple little areas here. I think we're gonna be really good. A little more dip dip. Oh, oh, you're gonna do the next one, hang on, hang on. Got it all, okay, ready for the next one? Yeah. All right, this one really doubled in size. All right, dip dip, fresh fresh. So if you have a helper like I do, you might want to get a little extra butter. <laughs> okay, my turn for a little bit. You gotta be real gentle, okay? Gentle. It smells like potato. It smells like potatoes? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, you get this whole area right here. Okay. So it's a little coated. Good. Oh, brush like you're painting. Yeah. Dip, dip. Uh, brush, brush, hey, brush. Hey, I only got it. <laughs> okay, you got it. All right. And then tell everyone we will see you in 30 to 45 minutes with our beautiful bread when it's done. Sound good? What, what all bread going to do? It's going to bake in the oven, and okay. then we're going to eat it. So say bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. <laughs> Look at Daddy. Hey, what are we about to do? Bread. Oh, we're gonna see what happened with the bread. See yeah. if we cook we need all the apron. Oh, you need an apron? Well, it's in the washing machine. I washed it because you had flour on it. Hey, our oven's hot or cold? Hot. So who has to take the bread out? That's right. And do you touch the things that come out, or do you not touch the things that come out? Oh, leave these here. I'm gonna put the hot stuff on it. Are you allowed to touch it? No. Okay. Are you ready to see the bread? You think we're gonna squish it again or are we just gonna eat it? <gasps> Squ squish it. I think we're gonna eat it. Here we go. Here's one. Can you even believe we made bread? No way. <laughs> and here's the crazy looking one. What? Oh my gosh, please I wear those. Yes, I highly recommend using actual bread pans and not casserole dishes. <laughs> because you're gonna have really tall bread you have to cut in half. Whoa, whoa. Did you do a good job? Yeah. Okay, show everybody your bread. Okay, ta-da.